I wouldn't be doing it if I didn't enjoy it. I'm just wondering whether it's a lot harder work, a lot greater effort to go after a concert after a concert. It's not so much the concerts, the, the, the effort, it's after the concert. <laughs> what do you mean by that? <laughs> well, I mean, you know, it's the actual... Uh, uh, I think I'm going to employ somebody to come around with me and put me in the room and lock the door, you know, mm -hmm. after the concert. Because we're, you know, we're inclined to whoop it up a bit. Would you describe yourselves as being pop stars in the conventional sense? Because you're not really, are you? Well, I don't consider us to be pop stars anyhow, you know. Uh, we're just a band and we're, we're playing the sort of music that we like to play and uh, enjoying it. I don't think I'm having a go at you about it, your age or anything, but how do you cope with, with groupies and <laughs> the young people? Not very well, actually. Do they go after you? No. Yes. No. Groupies. What do you think of groupies? All right. Girls, aren't they? <laughs> I guess. How long do you think you'll uh, be playing for? Another 20 years? Oh, I don't know. I think I did 20 years in Sydney last week. <laughs> yeah. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Just that bit of hard work up there was. You know what Max said, not the gig, the rest. The rest, the after, the, after, after the parties. Yeah. Well, you know, we haven't been back for about four years, and you, you might have about 400 friends, and you see them all in three days. You have to be around, yeah, and you have to, I mean, you can't expect it, the whole thing to happen straight away. I mean, sometimes it does, but I mean, uh, I think, uh, you really can't force yourselves on people. But uh, if you stay around long enough, sooner or later, they'll accept it, you know. The now seems all wrong. There's too much in between. Never be that way again. 